Welcome back to Math We Know. Solve the values of A, B, C from this system of equations. A plus B is equal to A, B, C. B plus C is equal to A, B, C. And C plus A is also equal to A, B, C. How should we solve it? You must have noticed the right hand sides have the same value A times B then times C. So this is the main line for us to solve this equation set. If I sort, one, two, three, okay. The right hand sides have the same value, A, B, C. First, we can subtract the first equation and the second equation. The first equation, the minus the second equation, you can get. The left hand side becomes a plus b minus bracket b plus c is equal to. The right hand side becomes a b c the minus a times b times c. Okay, what's the left hand side? It's very wonderful. a plus b the minus b minus c because here is plus and here is a symbol means minus is equal to abc the minus abc is zero have a look at it plus b minus b cancel and then a minus c is equal to zero it means a is equal to c we should get the relationship between a and B. Now we have to get the subtraction of the second equation and the third equation. Then B plus C, the minus C, the minus A is equal to ABC, the minus ABC is zero. So the same way. And you can get the left hand side is B plus C minus C cancel and then here plus becomes minus B minus A. The left hand side becomes zero because ABC, the minus ABC is zero. And then what should we get? B, the minus C is zero. It means B have the same value as A. Now, A is equal to C. B is equal to A. A is equal to C. A is equal to B. Then, what appears? Very good. Then we can get a and B and C, they have the same value. A is equal to B is equal to C. So now, we have known the relationship between A, B, and C. Then you can add, rewrite it. A plus B is equal to A, B, C. Now because A is equal to B is equal to C, I would like to write a and B and C all as A. Now, A plus A is the left hand side and the right hand side is a cube. So, A plus A is 2A. A times A then times A is a cube. So then, we minus 2A, subtract 2A on the both sides and you can get a cube, the minus 2a, is equal to 0. And then, what should we do? Factoring. So, factoring, we take an a out, and here left a square, the minus 2, is equal to 0. a squared, the minus 2, it can be also factoring. That is, a then times the third binomial formula. Come on. It is a then plus square root of 2 and then times a then minus square root of 2. So surely this equation has three roots. a1 is 0. a2 is minus square root of 2. And a3 is square root of 2. Our answer is a is equal to B is equal to C is equal to 0 or 
negative square root of 2 or square root of 2. And give me a thumbs up, subscribe my channel, ring the bell for more videos, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye!